In addition to the ability to trim and move timeline clip events, Vegas Pro and Vegas Movie Studio give you two additional and very useful editing techniques. A slip edit enables you to slip the media within an event without changing the position of the event itself. This can be very useful when you have an event positioned properly, but you decide that the media within the event isn't at precisely the right position. For instance, say you're cutting from one angle of a shot to another angle, and while you have the cut happening at the right time in your timeline, the first frame of the second clip doesn't match the last frame of the first clip. In this case, you can slip the media within the second event so that it starts at the right frame, and do so without changing the cut timing, which would happen if you move the event. To see how a slip edit works, add a video file to your timeline. Trim both ends of the event so that the remaining event doesn't show the entire media clip. Click the beginning of the event so that you see the first frame of the event in the video preview window. Now choose Edit, Editing Tool, Slip Tool. Now drag the middle of the event. Notice that the event does not move, but the media within it does. Also notice that the video preview splits into a two-up view with the first frame of the event on the left and the last frame of the video event on the right. This makes it easy to see the in and out points of the event as you slip the media within it. Next, choose Edit, Editing Tool, Slide Tool. Drag the middle of the event. This time the event moves while the media within it stays in its original position. This makes it easy to time the media in an event the way you want it in your project, but then change the portion of the media that you want to show. This can be extremely handy, for instance, if you've got a video timed to music and you want to change the portion of the video that you're showing in your project without changing the timing in relation to the music. Perhaps an even more powerful use of the slip tool enables you to change the cut point between two events on the timeline. To see this, add another event to your timeline and snap it to the first event. Now, with the Slip Edit tool still active, drag the edges of the events where they touch. This slides the edit point and lets you change the out point of the first event simultaneously with the beginning of the second event. To return to the Normal Edit tool, choose Edit, Editing Tool, Normal Editing Tool. Now, with the Normal Editing tool active, point to the middle of one of your events and hold the Alt key. This temporarily switches you to the Slip tool, and you can make a slip edit. When you release the Alt key, you return immediately to the Normal Edit tool. Now hold Control alt and point to the middle of the event. This switches you temporarily to the Slide tool. Click the event and perform a slide edit. Release the Control and Alt keys to return to the Normal Edit tool again. These tools work the same in all versions of Vegas Pro and Vegas Movie Studio Platinum.